This is why everybody should be Lutheran, because Lutherans have the pure gospel. And the pure gospel is this, that we have peace with God and the forgiveness of our sins, not by our own works or behavior or activity or thoughts or attitudes, but by faith in Jesus Christ, who was delivered up for our trespasses and raised for our justification. The Son of God, the one who formed the world, upholds it according to His word and His righteousness, certainly upholds also the standards and the law of God. He comes down from heaven in great humility, makes Himself poor, a slave, a human, makes Himself a sinner in our place. And He takes on the debt, the iniquity, the trespasses into His own body, nails them there on the cross, so that by His death and by the shedding of His blood, the debt is paid for. The wrath of God is satisfied. The penalty is completed in His body, in His body. In his act of great high priestly suffering, Jesus Christ makes atonement for the sins of the world and the complete debt which we owe to God. Therefore, we are exonerated of it. And of course, he's raised from the dead. He's raised from the dead to show the world that God has in fact accepted this sacrifice. There is now peace with us between God and ourselves. We are no longer sinners in the sense that God does not impute that sin to us, but instead declares that you are innocent. Therefore, if we are innocent before God, we have every expectation to hope for all good things from Him. And even our suffering, even the most terrible things that we can experience, are in fact coming to us from the hand of the one who has loved us and has himself experienced death and torture on our behalf. I'll get to this more later, but this is why all people ought to be Lutheran.